Hello Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs. Welcome to your monthly couples reading for February 2020. Before I start, I'd like to thank everyone who have subscribed to my channel. Those of you who have liked, shared, commented. Um, for those of you who are looking for a private reading with me, please do check my about page. All the information you need is there and once I hear from you, I'll get back to you as soon as possible. So today we're going to ask the tarot and the universe what is coming for your love life. And we've got a gilded tarot and we've got a sexual magic for the main energy. So we will just tuck in, okay? So tarot and universe, please tell us what's going to be the main energy for cancer couples, sun, moon, rising and Venus signs in the month of February. Seven of pentacles. Okay. This is tiredness, physical tiredness, okay? So we'll see what's going to happen because it looks like you guys will be possibly doing a lot of physical stuff because seven of pentacles is physical stuff. So, yes, a lot of drinking, a lot of all sorts, you know, yeah, <laughs> Okay, we're going to check things out. All right, so. Tarot and Universe, please tell us what is coming for Cancer Couples. Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs in February. I'll take this one, okay? And the rest, I will go this way. How is second week looking for Cancer? Third week. How is fourth week looking for cancer? Okay. The bottom deck is eight of cups. Okay. So your first week, the page of cups was trying to show up. So I decided to pick him for you. Your second week is the star. Okay. And your third week is eight of pentacles. And your fourth week is the chariot. Yes, Cancer. This is looking interesting because in your first week, this page here is telling you there's going to be some form of action. Okay? There's going to be some form of action. And this action... Is going to be news of love. Whatever you and your your partner, I feel like having this um, eight of cups here and this chariot. Okay, I feel most of you have partners, or your your lover, or your boyfriend or girlfriend is overseas, because this is the chariot. Okay, so there's some type of travel involved or oversee connection there that is how i'm feeling here okay okay so it could be that this person that you are you see as your lover is coming in for you and bringing you news of their deeper affection for you and they certainly want to be energetic with you in every shape or form okay because this this is the seven of pentacles and seven of pentacles is i feel for most of you is a relationship that has been going on for a while and i feel for some of you it's overseas it's something that's been going on but i feel for most of you you are meeting in february and you are really I think um, a lot of physical things are going to happen 
a lot of reds and yeah you name it because this is this is action a lot of actions and this is tiredness so i feel you'll be doing a lot of things that you will enjoy and you'll be physically tired that's how i can put it okay and then in your second week this is the 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 star card and i feel yeah um whatever you are hoping for in the second week um, in terms of uh, your relationship, whether you want your relationship to move forward, what, whichever way you're looking at it, I feel, yes, the second week, this is where you feel more confident that, yeah, whatever decision you make, because this is an Aquarius. And when you have this, um, this star card in a relationship reading, it signifies someone who is possibly your soulmate or someone that you have a soul connection to. And so I feel like, yes, um, this is someone that you have some type of spiritual connection to. This person you are in a relationship with or, um, yes, I feel like, and I feel, yes, there's going to be a lot of nakedness. That's how I, I mean, I've always seen the star card, but especially in this deck, I've always um, been more attracted here. But today, I'm more attracted to the fact that the woman is naked. So I feel in February, there's going to be a lot of nakedness for you Cancerians. You know, sun, moon, rising and Venus signs. Yeah. So if this, this card is telling you tiredness, physical tiredness, you have put in a lot of effort for this relationship. And I feel however tired you are, is it going to be an enjoyable tiredness? <laughs> yes 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 and in the third week here you are working on something physical here i feel you know you are going to work on your relationship in every shape and form and i feel yes this is is going to be um more you know i feel you you know you'll be doing things with your partner physical things a lot of physical stuff because I feel more drawn to the green. And green is talking about love and trust. You see here, we also have green. Okay. So I feel you, you, you will feel like you can trust your partner more. And I'm drawn to the red here, which is your, your physical, um, you know, anything that is helping you to move forward as well looking at that you know you'll be moving forward in the relationship i'm drawn to the colors here okay so this this is good this is nakedness this is nakedness and this is um you know you, you'll be getting very very physical and you'll be tired whatever you'll be doing it will be more pleasurable for you you'll be you have balance Yes, that's, that's how I'm going to, you know, keep it. And of course, in the fourth week, some of you, um, I feel in the fourth week, you'll be thinking of certainly moving the relationship forward. Some of you will be traveling in the fourth week of February. It could be that you'll be leaving where you are to join your partner or your partner leaving where they are to join you. Because here... The base is moving away from wherever you are currently. So you are leaving a certain situation and moving forward. So, certainly, this is eight, this is eight. There's certainly that you'll be working on and this is departure. This is also, so certainly in the fourth week, some of you and most of you will be physically relocating. Okay. Yeah. You will be relocating and this will be like going for a long time, like a proper, a proper departure. You're not going for holiday. This is not a holiday card. This is you going for a long time relocate into another country another city another town something like that so cancer 
I hope this has been insightful for you. I wish you all the best. By all means, please check your general reading and see how you connect it here. And I will leave you here. And I wish you all the best. And I'll see you next month or you see me next month.